It's Zach's guess your weight, eh? Bet you can't guess how heavy I am. It's over 100 pounds because I ate, literally ate 100 pounds of cake like 20 minutes ago. Excuse me, why are you wearing a bag on your head? Huh? What? Oh, I was hiding out from the sweet troops, man. Are they gone? I don't see anybody. Great! Thanks for waking me up, bruh. I'm Zach Zook. I'm Pajama Sam. Hey, that's cool. Say, Pajama Sam, what are you? About 42 pounds? I don't know. Zach Zook is never wrong about these things, my man. You weigh 42 pounds. Okay. <laughs> he doesn't guess your weight. He determines your weight. Like, you are, snap, 42 pounds. I guess I am now. Also, I love how he's Zach-kini. <laughs> like, zucchini. That's pretty good. Do you think I could use your bag? Somebody after you? Sure, take it, bro. I don't need it anymore. <laughs> Well, that's kind of sad that he felt like he had to disappear when the sweet troops were around. That's that's actually kind of sad. Nice board shorts, a nice Hawaiian shirt, nice flip-flops, nice sunglasses. This guy's dressed to impress. Hey, Zach. My man Sam, 42-pounder, how is it? Are you really always right about how much people weigh? I'm the best weight guesser on the island. I'm the only weight guesser on the island. Hey, Zach. Mr. Pajama Sam, big 42 pounds. What's the zone, man? How many weight guessers are there on the island? Uh, uh, uh. Just me, man. Yep. Hey, Zach. Yo, PJ Sam, 42 pounds. What's up? Is weight guessing a good job? Well, you know, it keeps the rent paid since the old business went under. Literally. <laughs> yeah. yeah, okay. Welcome to Muscle Beach. Zach, guess your weight. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he used to have kayaks, but then they took them all. Aw. At least we have Sprinkle. Hey, it's the baguette! Hi, I'm Pajama Sam. Are you one of the delegates for the peace conference? But yes, I am Pierre Le Pen of the Breads and Grains Group. Can you get down from there? Alas, no, I am trapped. The Ferris wheel, she has no power. The exercise machine on the beach furnishes the power, but no one seems to be exercising, and so she does not move. <laughs> hmm, well, I'll think of something. <laughs> Thank you. For the peace conference to be deprived of Pierre? <sighs> this is not good. <laughs> Nobody's exercising. I feel you there, Pierre. That feels all too real. <laughs> Hey, dude! Ha <laughs> ha! But seriously, folks, let me ask you this. What goes ha 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 ha, plop, plop, plop? An orange holding its breath. Hey! You ain't funny! Bring back the other guy! Don't you get it? Orange, breath, plop, plop, plop? Clop this, wise guy. <laughs> Aw, poor guy. How did they just have a pumpkin to fry them? But hey, tell me, what do you think of these shoes, eh? <laughs> thank you, thank you. All right, next up is Tom Rutabaga, the Knock Knock King. Aw, he's so sad. How about a nice hand for Mickey Hollandaise, folks? <laughs> <laughs> Mickey Hollandaise in his great big floppy shoes! Wow. All right, folks, check this out. It'll knock you right out of your seat. Knock, knock. Who's there? Omelette. Omelette who? I'm a lot fattier than Mickey Holliday's is. <laughs> Ouch. You can see why they call me the though. Knock Knock King. Knock Knock. Who's there? Butter. Butter who? Butter open the door or I'll knock knock it down. <laughs> he actually 
actually tells legitimately funny knock knock jokes. <laughs> he is the knock knock king for a reason. Let's hear some more. Oh, hey, check this out! Knock knock! <laughs> Who's there? Anna! Anna who? Anybody know any more knock knock jokes? <laughs> Try this one! Knock knock! Who's there? Ice cream! Ice cream who? I scream when people don't open a door for me! <laughs> Some of these are clever. Some more than others. Knock, knock! Who's there? Mikey! Mikey who? My key is in the pocket of my other pants! Open the door! <laughs> oh, I mean... It, yeah. Okay, let, let's, let's let's go inside this guy's mouth. Yes, please. <laughs> oh, man, this guy looks sad. Hi! I, um, I saw your act. <sighs> Tell me the truth. Did I stink? Well... I knew it. Oh, I am awful. No, I wouldn't say that. I haven't been able to tell a decent joke since... Well, since those sweet troopers marched through here and got my note cards all out of order. I'm a lousy comedian. <laughs> hmm. How big are these shoes anyway? They're size 37. I got them cheap from a big hairy guy in California who said he didn't like the colors. <laughs> wow. How big did you say these shoes were again? Size 37. Where have we heard that shoe size before, eh? <laughs> a box top. We did not hear it at the box top, no sir. We, have, we, we literally just need one more box top. It's either on this quadrant or it's next to, or it's in the telescope, I think. Say, is it alright if I take your pumpkin? Sure, kid. Knock yourself out. Thanks. What kind of person in the audience just happened to have a pumpkin? Like, I'm gonna take this pumpkin to the comedy club, and if the act is terrible, I'm gonna throw it at their head. Like, what kind of terrible person does that? <laughs> oh, he's happy. <coughs> um, that's a weird coat hanger. That's the one I like to see. I wish I had a better head for jokes. You don't like your head? I can never remember the punchlines. That's why I have to use those note cards, but now they're all out of order. Why are you a professional comedian then? Oh wait, he's not a professional, he's amateur. How did you say your note cards got messed up again? It was the sweet troops marching through here. I think they did it on purpose. No senses of humor on those guys. Yeah, that sounds about right. Let me take a look at your note cards. Maybe I can help put them back in order. Be my guest. So yeah, we gotta get his note cards in the right order. What's round and tiny and blue, an audience laughing their heads off. What? <laughs> so you can kinda take a look at these. What's small and red and goes 60 miles an hour, but it's wood and a toothbrush. What can you use to make a salad, build a boat, and brush your teeth? I don't know, but it's crawling on your shoulder. <laughs> these are terrible. Yeah, but you have basically have to figure out which punchline goes with which one. Um Lettuce? Don't maybe there's a better <laughs> Let's send him out. <laughs> there. Why don't you try them now? Hey, I think you're right. I think this is better. I'm going to try them. I'm going to try them without the shoes. Really big hat, ladies and gentlemen, the occasionally funny Mickey Hollandaise. I got a joke for you. Um, here it is. What's round and tangy and blue? Lettuce, wood, and a toothbrush. That's not funny. Boo. You think? But hey, check out these shoes, huh? Thank you, thank you, and thank you, Mickey. That was, well, it was. <laughs> Do they just laugh uproariously every time they see the shoes? <laughs> what a dumb audience. <laughs> Sorry about that. How did you say your note cards got messed? You hear he already told us. Try this one! Knock, Gotta knock. hear more of this there. guy. Little old lady! Little old lady who? The yodeling contest is tomorrow! Today we'll do a knock-knock joke! Please stick to the program! <laughs> <laughs> you like that, huh? Okay, how about this one? Knock knock! Who's there? Isabel! Isabel who? <laughs> Is a bell pepper the red kind or the green kind? <laughs> <laughs> These are legitimately good knock knock jokes. Come on. I got a million of them! Knock knock! <laughs> Who's there? Avocado! Avocado who? Avocado to keep me from falling out when I drive! 
<laughs> you can see why they call me the Knock Knock King. Knock Knock. Who's there? Artichoke. Artichoke who? Artichoke because he eats too fast. <laughs> oh, all right. Well, I think Nikki Hollandaise is beyond saving. Also, great punny name. Let's check out the rest of the beach, shall we? Muscle Beach is a pretty cool area. Oh, hey. Every beach has those girls that are sun tanning. Hi, what's up? Oh, you know, we're just baking, you know? <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, but then you're going to get dried out, and nobody likes dried out cupcakes. How will you know when you're done baking? Like, we use a timer, you know? PTH will be totally over when the bell rings. Hmm. What does PTH mean again? Hello? Pete Tanning Hours? I'm so sure. Okay, what are you guys doing? Boy, you guys look healthy. Yeah, we know. <laughs> the cup, the cupcakes are the girls that are sweet, and then the muffins are the healthier ones. That's funny. Shouldn't you be working out or something? Not now, dude. We're busy. We have to draw those cupcakes for our art class. Is it really for an art class or for something else? It's for an art class, kids, obviously. <laughs> They're modeling for them. Do you guys like to work out? Oh, yeah. Working out is almost as important to us as our drawing assignment. But not quite. We've got to draw those cupcakes so we can be famous artists someday. I see. <laughs> And you're drawing their their frosting, eh? It's a good thing there are some cupcakes here for you to draw, isn't it? I don't know what we'd do if they weren't around. Well, there's always the exercise machine. <laughs> I love how he sounds like yeah. Arnold. Yeah. This exercise machine is connected to the Ferris wheel. Why? Yeah, that's right, little dude. When we work out, it makes the wheel go around. That is the weirdest entry to the county fair I've ever seen. <laughs> a Ferris wheel that's attached to an exercise machine. It's kind of cool, but also, like, don't get on it or else you might not be able to get off it. If, yeah. All right, well, we can't leave Nikki Holliday's you you're a discerning audience. But we also can't keep Tom Rudebeck away. Anna. Anna who? Anybody know any more knock-knock jokes? Well, that's kind of up. He's like, no, seriously, I'm out of material. I need Nikki Holidays to go on. Let me have another look at your cards. I really think I can help you get them organized. Well, it certainly can't get any worse. <laughs> Just don't send me out and make me look like an idiot again. All right, let's round a tiny and blue and orange for the audience breath. breath. I think that one's funny. All right. Uh, what can you can use to make a solid build a boat and brush your teeth, lettuce, wood, and a toothbrush? I think that one's funny. I don't know. A straw, but that might work. Maybe there's a better match for that. Yeah, so I think once you've matched it. An orange hole. Maybe there's that. No, no you can't switch there. them around. <laughs> We're going to make as many of them correct as possible while still getting some wrong. So that's only we can only get the first three, right? Okay. This time I think the audience will like it. Also, apparently Nikki Hollandaise just does not understand jokes. Which is why he became a comedian. <laughs> Hey, he slips hey, up a I lot. I think you're right. I think this is better. I'm going to try them. I'm going to try them without the shoes. <laughs> really big hat, ladies and gentlemen, the occasionally funny Mickey Hollandaise. <laughs> Ouch. I got a joke for you. Um, here it is. What's round and tangy and blue and orange holding its breath? <laughs> Uh, how about this? What's small and red and goes 60 miles an hour? A strawberry driving a car. Oh, well, now think about this. What can you use to make a salad, build a boat, and brush your teeth? I don't know. What? Lettuce, wood, and a toothbrush. Okay, that what has good. yellow and green stripes, 600 legs, and great big fangs? An audience laughing their heads off. That's not funny. You stink! But hey, check out these shoes, huh? Thank you, thank you, and thank you, Mickey. That was, well, it was. Well, well, we tried. <laughs> Sorry, dude. Gotta get his shoes, though. Those shoes are styling. Let me have another look at your cards. 
I really think. Yeah, we literally just swapped the last two. And I think, I think that. There we go. I'm going to try them. I'm going to try them without the shoes. Here we go. Time for your big performance, Nikki. Or Mickey, whatever your name is. <laughs> Ooh, hey, check it out. I've got another one for you. Who's there? It's me, Mickey Hollandays, hot banana for all your comedy needs. May I have the spotlight, please? Hey! Now this joke was a favorite of my close personal friend, Elvis Parsley. What's round and tangy and blue? And orange holding its breath. <laughs> <laughs> They already heard that one. <laughs> the steak is asleep. Just ask me, what's small and red and goes 60 miles an hour? Anyone? Huh? Huh? It's a strawberry driving a car. You all heard these jokes. They're still laughing. These guys oh, laugh yeah. at the same jokes. And here's one of the deeper mysteries. What can you use to make a salad, build a boat, and brush your teeth? Lettuce, wood, and a toothbrush. <laughs> Of all of his jokes, that one's the stupidest. You, ma'am, there in the front row. Tell me, what has yellow and green stripes, 600 legs, and great big fangs? Why, I don't know. I don't know either, but it's crawling on your shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding, ma'am. No harm done, I hope. Now, does anyone know what goes ha, 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 plop, plop, plop? An audience laughing their heads off. <laughs> Those were your five jokes, and now you've used them and can't use them again. Boy, that went really well. It was my finest performance, and I owe it all to you. Thank you for helping me put my jokes and my career back together. You're welcome. And as for you, you great unwieldy galoshes, I shall need you no more. Now, if you'll excuse me, young man, I've got to go and have a little talk with my agent. You need more jokes. You only have five, and you need note cards to remember them. You're not a very good comedian, but we can steal his shoes now. he doesn't need these anymore, so I guess it's okay if I take them. <laughs> It's okay to steal things if nobody wants them. That is a, not a lesson you should take away from Pajama Sam Free Kids. You like that, huh? Okay, okay good. He's back. This one? The that funny guy is back. Isabel. Isabel. We've heard that Isabel one. Pepper, the red kind or the green kind? I thought he had more knock-knock jokes than that. Alright, we still haven't explored the balloon area yet. Let's go over here. Oh. <laughs> this guy looks fun. Hi. You sell balloons? Give the boy a college scholarship. He's a genius. What did you say? Do you like selling balloons? Oh, yeah. It's the fulfillment of all my hopes and dreams. <laughs> this guy's great. What happens if you sell all your balloons? I can buy a new pair of shoes. Velcro shoes. What's wrong with the ones you've got? Nothing if you've got all day to tie them. The laces keep coming undone. Yeah, I feel you, bro. I think helium balloons are a lot more fun than the regular kind. Personally, I prefer a trip to Rio de Janeiro, but what do I know? Wow, this guy's so sour, it's great. <laughs> Please pose for your picture. Oh yeah, this is where you can pose Pajama Sam for different pictures and it's fantastic. Huh? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, you can make him pose in all of these weird different <laughs> poses. <laughs> and then you can actually print pictures out. I can't print a picture out because I don't have a printer. And my computer's not hooked up to one. But you guys can. Feel free to have... <laughs> Feel free to make as many weird faces as you want. <laughs> it's pretty fun. Hey, it's a hammer. Let's try the, the strength game, shall we? We are... Semi strong. Me and the bell were just closer together. This wouldn't be so hard. <laughs> Looks like Sam's gonna have to work out before he can make the bell ring. <laughs> These shoes are kind of weird. Say, 
Those are nice. Oops. Way to go, Sam. Darn these laces. They're always coming undone. Here, kid, hold these for me, would you? Pajama Sam always helps those in need. Whoops. Um. Uh, okay, that's normal. Punch it. <laughs> Thanks, kid. You're welcome. <laughs> no problem. Also, last box, box top. top. I think this makes 20. Yes, it does. 20. To the Chocomot Company from Pajama Sam. Pajama Sam with the Titanic Elbow Rust. And that's all it does. You literally just get, a, like, an animation of him flexing his muscles. But that's all I needed. That's all I wanted. Honest, I hate to admit it, but Pajama Sam 2 had the best reward where you could at least print out the picture of your puzzle. And then Pajama Sam 1, you could keep clicking the sock menu over and over again until the washing machine overflowed. But, honestly, the reward for collecting all the collectibles was kind of lame. But this one's different. Seeing Pajama Man flex is totally worth it. Pajama Sam, you were the worst. Oh, not again. Would you mind holding these again? Okay. That's not how helium balloons work. Well, now we can cheat at the game. <laughs> Whoop, there's the bell. We're done, girls. Peak tanning hours are over. Bye-bye, boys. Let's go get some frozen yogurt. Oh. Darn. I hope they come back tomorrow. But will be done until then. We'll work out some more. What else? Yeah. All right. <laughs> All right. Well, hopefully those exact same cupcakes come in the exact same poses tomorrow. Kesu could say the Wii eternals. I am saved. Um, help. Courage, mon ami. You must grab onto the wheel. Zoot. Ouch. Sorry about that. Ah, excellent. Now we are both severed, and I can continue on to the Conference of Peace. Hey, dude. Say, what happened to my... Sorry, man. Oh, shoot. oh, well, I needed a new career anyhow. Mm, perhaps you can start the taxi service. I need to go to the food pyramid. Can you take me there? Sure, hop in. Au revoir, my pajama friend. Yeah, the bean was a nice guy after all. Au revoir. <laughs> That's two down, two to go. All right, sweet. We saved Zabegat. Zabegat is very easy to save if he's on the Ferris wheel. <laughs> you literally just go to the screen, pick up the hammer, pull the guy's shoelaces, and hit the bell. It's really easy. Hi guys. Mm. That looks hard. Uh. What's up? Oh. Alright, they're just grunting. Let's leave him alone. I think that's almost I think that's basically everything we need to do in Muscle Beach. Muscle Beach is a pretty cool place. Hey Zach, my man. Hey Zach. Yo, PJ Sam, 42 pounds. What's up? Is weight guessing really a good job? Not really, no. But I'm good at it. <laughs> I can sure you are. Again. Hop on. Let's go back to the first area. There's more stuff we can do now. 